Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for August 11th of 2025 is titled Closest Ever Images Near the Sun. So, what do we see here? Well, here we see a set of images taken over the period of about seven hours, and they're compressed to just a five-second loop that will be repeated here for you to kind of look at as we discuss it. Now, this is a set of images taken by the Parker Solar Probe, which has been going since 2018 when it was launched and put into an orbit that brings it very close to the sun. And in fact, this was its closest approach in December of last year, which was the closest approach any human-made object has made it to the sun. So, object here sent from Earth with the purpose of studying the sun, getting as close as we can right now. How close is that? Well, that's about five times the diameter of the sun. Now, that would be about seven million kilometers, or a little over four million miles away from the sun, which might seem like a tremendous distance still, but we have to remember how intense the sun is. Trying to get the closer you try to get, the harder it is for that spacecraft and the more damage it is likely to undergo. So this is still incredibly close and gives us really a first up-close look at the sun and that we can see directly. Now, yes, we can take images of the sun from Earth and get get decent detail on them. But there is also something else to be said for actually being there, being as close to the sun as you can. And you notice that, that in the video, you can see great detail in the solar flares and coronal mass ejections that we see in the material that is coming out from the sun. And we want to know more about that because that does affect us here on Earth. That material does, in some cases, stream out toward Earth and can cause damage to things like communication satellites and our power grids, as well as giving us the beautiful aurora that we often see when the sun is at its most intense in terms of activity. So, really getting to study anything up close is a lot better than studying it from a great distance. Now, we don't always have that as an option, but here for the first time, we're really getting up close and looking at the sun and hopefully learning a little bit more about what we'd call space weather, how the sun affects the Earth. Now, we know the immediate effects. Yes, the sun is the source of most of our energy here on Earth. But that can also affect us as well when the sun is more uh, energetic. And that can cause, as I've said, things like the aurora that can be very prominent in the sky, but can also the, dis disrupt the communication satellites and other material by the intense amount of charged particles coming from the sun. So the more we learn about that, the more we're able to predict what might be coming toward Earth in the next solar storm. So that was our picture of the day for August 11th of 2025. It was titled, Closest Ever Images Near the Sun. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Sky Flow. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.